Welcome to a new vlog. Today I am pretty much having a chill day, except I am getting ready to go to lunch with a friend. I work with her, so um, whenever she gets her hair done, it's always like two minutes away from my house. So we meet up for lunch. So I am just gonna get ready because I don't know, I just feel like it. I never really get ready, um, especially working from home and stuff. So I will show you my outfit after, but I wanna film a TikTok and I wanted to talk about this app. This is not sponsored. Um, they do not need me to sponsor them because they're such a big company, but it's called Adobe Rush and it's so much easier. If you're like an actual editor, I know that sounds like crazy, and kind of like mean in a way, but if you're an actual editor and you use the Adobe products, like this app is just so easy to use and it's not like InShot where like you don't know what any of the tools do. I don't know, maybe it's just me, but this is what the app looks like. Um, it's called RU, like it has the RU and it's called Premiere Rush and you can just import your videos like vertically and you edit like that and then when you export it's not like iMovie iMovie like weirdly crops my videos so it's not like the entire like vertical 16 by like 9 you know what i mean i don't know but when you export it's the right size you can separate the video and audio so i can just use the audios from tiktok um so it's just really nice and then you can just upload that video from your camera roll to like Instagram and TikTok and then you won't have like the watermark. So I'm gonna do like a get ready with me Asian girl edition for TikTok. I'm gonna see how it does. I'm probably gonna post it too on Instagram reels just because I don't know, I need to be posting more reels. And now I have this app and it's super easy to use. So I'm gonna do that. I'm just gonna time lapse this for you guys because I don't know, I feel like it just gets repetitive and like me talking during the foundation portion is just really boring. I don't know, it's boring for me to watch just because it takes forever. The foundation is probably like the part that takes the longest because you have to like blend it and make sure it like looks good. So yeah, um, I have to edit a video. As you saw, I got laundry started. I need to boil my eggs for this week. Um, just like Sundays are always like big reset days. I also need to film a video, like a main channel style video. So I have a third video for this week. Three videos a week is really hard when you actually do things on the weekends. So that's why it's just a little bit more difficult, but I like having more entertaining content. But I swear a lot of these vloggers, they just like talk to the camera like this. So I don't know, maybe I'm doing something wrong. Cause I was like, scrubbing through some people's like vlogs, the ones that are like 30 minutes long. And I'm like, how does, how does that happen? How does that work? And it was like big chunks of them like talking. So maybe I need to do that. And you guys seem to really like when I talk. I am just going to get on with the time lapse and you guys can see some behind the scenes of the TikTok I'm gonna make. So yeah, I'm just gonna do like video clips. It's not gonna be any like crazy thing that's happening in the TikTok. It's just gonna be like really basic but I'm gonna get started now. Okay guys, so this is the completed makeup look. I'll come over here so you guys can see more realistically. Um, the brows give me a hard time. I say that in every clip. My lips, I bought, well, you guys probably already saw the vlog of me um, going shopping. The lips are the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk, the lipstick, the matte lipstick, and I think it looks really good. I put some um, clear chapstick on over it just cuz, but I think it looks pretty good and it's just a lot easier than using the lip pencil like all over my lips, so I think we're gonna use the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk lipstick um, instead. And I did use the lip liner like to actually line my lips, but 
the lipstick looks good and then now I'm going to show you my outfit this is the fit today we're rocking um, this like faux fur jacket I took this to New York Fashion Week like in 2019 then I have just like my black turtleneck on with um, my Gucci belt and black jeans and these Uggs just because it's cold out and in Florida you need to have Uggs when it's like 40 degrees out so yeah this is my outfit and now I'm gonna edit the TikTok I filmed I don't know when my friend's gonna be like ready to go to lunch and I don't want to be like in the middle of editing my vlog during that time so I'll probably just do that when I get back but um, the TikTok won't take that long friend got this fun drink and now I'm gonna have to get one. Want to say hi to the vlog? This is Ashley. Oh, she has a podcast so I will link it down below in their Instagram. Check it out. I just want to plug that in there. Recap and podcast. I know it's hard these days with like social media. It's like so hard. Like, And oh my gosh, this, <laughs> this makes it look so huge. No, I got a glass of white Zinfandel. Peer pressure because my friend got a drink. So We are just enjoying this interrupting our chat because I forgot to vlog the food. I got a chicken salad, so good. And then she got the Alfredo, right? The chicken Alfredo, is yeah. it good? <laughs> so, I didn't forget, I still have the chicken. The chicken's very good quality, so I'm impressed. Okay, so I'm on my way home now, but I got a Starbucks uh, little treat. It's a tall um, almond milk honey flat. A white flat flat white uh, something along those lines but if you just like look that up I'm sure you can find it but I'm gonna try it and see if I like it I'll probably like burn myself because I always do that so let's give it a try I hope it's been long enough okay well kind of did burn myself it's very very strong that's all I'm gonna say I don't know if it's my favorite drink probably not gonna get this again but it's very like, it's very strong, in my opinion. It's like strong coffee flavor. Okay, so I just got back from lunch. It was so good. And as you guys saw, I tried a flat white. I just wanted to, just because. Probably won't get this drink again because it's like pretty strong. Excuse me, the coffee flavor. But it's not bad. Um, it's okay. But good thing I just got a tiny one because... I wanted to just try it and that green drink the matcha really does grow on you because like I was in the shower last night or like early this morning and I was like I'm kind of craving one like I don't know it's definitely a drink I'll get again but I think it's like a summertime drink so I'm definitely gonna get it like when it's hotter out and now I'm gonna get to filming Whew, guys I really want just like a day of doing nothing I was gonna do nothing today but I need to finish the laundry I need to edit at least one video, so I'm gonna do that. So I'm going to get to filming now. I don't know why, I'm just so tired. I think it's the weather. Good morning, guys. It is Monday morning. It is 40 degrees out. I am freezing. That's why I got a hot beverage. I'm gonna try for you on camera today. It's another new drink. It smells really good. I think I'm really gonna like this one. Um, today, I had a short cycle bar class because they ran out of power. Oh my gosh, I thought you guys were gonna slip. They ran out of power like three times. So it was just like kind of funny because it would turn off and then they'd be like, oh, it's turned back on. We lost air conditioning, which I didn't personally feel it because I was still like cold and stuff. So it didn't really matter if we had air conditioning or not. Um, so after we did the arm workouts, he was just like, okay, class is done because we didn't have any music. The lights were like all on like the normal lights. Had a short cycle bar class, but it's okay. Um, we made it at least 30 minutes. But today I'm gonna be trying the tall caramel macchiato with almond milk instead of like the 2% milk. Um, I just personally like almond milk with coffee a lot better than 2% milk. It doesn't taste like that different, but you can tell the difference if you get what I mean. It's not like drastic, but it's like ever so slightly. And I just think that almond milk is like healthier. So anyway, I'm gonna try it. Mm. It's pretty good. I really like it. I like it. I like it a lot better than the last drink I had. 
it's very light. It's a very light taste. I'm waiting till I get to the bottom. I'll probably get more um, caramel because I do like the caramel in the drinks. I think it's so good. This is really good. I really like it. I did not like that flat white yesterday. I drank it just because, but I'm probably never getting that one again. But this one's good. I will get this one again. Um, it's a nice light, perfect for the morning time. I recommend. So I don't know if I mentioned this in another video, but um, it's been a couple days. I got some packages, so I wanted to share them with you guys. Um, I saw Sierra really liked this Living Proof Perfect Dry Perfect Hair Day shampoo, and it just looks like this. I got it on Amazon. I can't wait to try it. I'm almost out of my large size dry shampoo, um, the Amica one, so I wanted to try this one to see if I like it any better. It was kind of expensive, so I'm like hoping that it's like the real deal. Hey there, Sherry. Anyway, <laughs> you can see her, she's like a little speck. I then got this cute package dress from Luke and Gray. I was browsing their like February, like Valentine's Day collection, and this is like so cute. It's like a little baby doll dress. So, this is what it looks like. Oh, it's so cute. I used some of my rewards too, so I could get this dress. But so this is what it looks like. Oh my God, how freaking cute. <gasps> okay, I'm gonna try it on really quick so I can show you guys. Hopefully it like fits well. I'm gonna keep the tag on just in case. I'm super excited. They have this little um, returns policy card in here. So I'm hoping and thinking it will fit. I'm gonna try it on now. Okay, so what do we think? It's kind of not like fluffed out, but I think it's adorable. I love it. It fits. My boobs are a little big though, cause like they like, <laughs> I guess TMI, but they kind of like go below the hem, not hem, but like the stitches here. But it's fine. Cause like you can't really notice it uh, like here. It's just more, I can feel it. Um, this is what the back looks like. It's cute and it's really comfortable except for like the arms are kind of itchy, not gonna lie, but it'd be fun to like take pictures in, go to like brunch in, that sort of thing. It's kind of like baby doll style. So yeah, I'm impressed and can't wait to wear it. I think a large would be too big. So um, yeah, the I'm just gonna have to deal with the boob issue, but it's fine, you can't really tell, so. I love it, so freaking cute. Okay guys, I wanted to try the dry shampoo that I got, the living proof one. And by the way, I'm wearing the same thing cause like I just showered and like, I don't know. I don't, there's no real reason why like I would need to like wear something else and it's freezing here still. It's a little warmer, but all right. Oh my gosh, it doesn't really smell like anything. Hold on, let me just. It smells pretty fresh and like my grandma kind of. I mean, that sounds like crazy, kind of weird. Like, kind of like, uh, oh my gosh, that was way too much. Oops, my bad. Kind of smells like beach. <laughs> smells like beach mixed with like old lady. I don't know if that makes sense. Okay, well, that's my first impression of it. I'm sure it's pretty good quality. It, a lot of product comes out all at once, so. That's kind of crazy. That's the first impression of the new dry shampoo, Living Proof. Oh my gosh, stuff, man. Okay, well that was all for this clip because I don't know, I worked today, so got nothing huge going on. But yesterday I went on a shoot with um, another like department and that was fun, so. I just put a poll up on my like community tab to ask you guys like what, like how long do you like videos? So if you could answer that, please put 10 minutes cause like I can't make my videos longer. It's just, just so hard. But anyway, now I'm just starting to ramble. So I'm gonna cut the camera off. Quick little unbagging because as you guys know, um, I bought a few things online. Um, I think I know what this is, but I'm not sure. Um, but this is from Lululemon. 
it is the bra. I will try this on a little later. Um, I just wanted to embag it for you. It is the energy bra. I didn't get the long line because like the long line part kind of like, I don't know, it's just kind of annoying. So this is the color. I think it's so cute. It reminds me of the kick-ass like nude pink color. It's like a ballerina pink though. It's so nice. I love it. Little crisscross back. It has high support, like medium to high, and it's cute. So I got this with my little gift card that I got for Christmas. And this is what the new sports bra looks like. I love it so much. Definitely going to be getting very good use out of this. This is what the back looks like. And yeah, I really like it. It's super comfortable and it like holds me in, which I really like. Okay, so since y'all like long videos, I checked the poll. I'm gonna add this clip in because I got another package. Guys, I just put on the sports bra for trying this on. I haven't been wearing this all day. Um, but I got the Define jacket from Lululemon because they finally like restocked it and they never like have anything in stock. With a company this like big and like hype right now, you would think that they would like always have stuff. Um, but I guess it's like supply and demand, you know. Anyway, I'm so excited. I'll tell you guys after I get the jacket on like the whole story and spiel about this because there was some drama that happened. Not like huge drama, but yeah. Also, if you guys have um, tried this mirror thing, let me know how you like it. It seems like really cool. And if I had like an extra thousand dollars, just like chilling out like i would probably invest in one to like try it out just watching some tv and stuff um here it is it's so nice it's very like it's light but also like so soft oh my gosh this almost this kind of feels like the leggings oh my goodness all right let me unzipper her this is so cool okay so got a size eight hopefully this works because Anyway, it's supposed to be like tight and form fitting. Yeah, oh my gosh, guys. I'm so happy I went with the size eight because I don't think I would be able to fit into a size six. Like I could, but it would be like a tighter squeeze and I don't want it to be like too tight, you know? And then the zippers here unzip like so cute i really like it this is what it looks like on i'm like wearing all lulu right now so super cute okay so the drama with this jacket i ordered one but i was like oh i think i'm a size six because i don't know i just thought i was a size six so i ordered the size six everything and then i started looking online to see like reviews and stuff and sizing and everyone was saying no I went with a size 8 and they were like giving their measurements and everything and I'm like oh I should have gotten the size 8 so I was trying to like cancel my order but you have to like do the online chat or you have to like or you have to like call the office the, like the headquarters or wherever so I like I'm on the phone and then I'm like talking to this automated thing and they're basically like, um, what do you need to do? And like the automated thing was not very helpful. So I was like trying to get to a human, finally got to a human and they're like, um, we can cancel the order. And I was like, okay, just need to make sure I get like my money back. Cause like this jacket is kind of expensive. Like it's not cheap. So he canceled the order. I shortly got an email after saying like, it's confirmed. You don't have an order. And I was like, okay, good. When do I get my money back? And they're like, oh, it's not going to be long. And it really wasn't that long. And then I just immediately ordered the one in my size because like they had it and I didn't like want to wait. And this jacket is just like pretty popular. So I didn't, and I wanted the black one. They have a cute white one too, but white, I just feel like would get so dirty. So I went with the black one. Everything just about this jacket is really nice. So that is it for this clip. I ended um, the video in another clip, so I'll just like throw that at the end of the video. 
I think I'm going to end the vlog here because I need to edit this sometime today. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! Thank you.